Hey guys, Pretzel here, and today we are going to be talking about Sorry about that. Chewing on a seed from my smoothie. As you can see. So, today I'm going to be talking about Godzilla versus King Kong and, well, technically my thoughts about it. Now, uh, officially I'm not much of a King Kong, no, not much of a King Kong fan, but I do like King Kong, he, I think he's pretty cool, and my technically most favorite part about him is, like, when he beats his chest and, like, opens the jaw of the dinosaurs and rips them out and stuff, which is, I haven't really seen a good King Kong movie in a really long time. So I'm looking forward to the one that's coming up in uh, two months. Two months, guys. Two months. So, yeah. And technically after that, the King Kong movie, we then we have Godzilla 2. Now, Godzilla 2, I'm super excited to see. Especially when it has freaking um, King Ghidorah, Mothra, and Rodan. Bringing back some of the old friends. Which is, I already know what Rodan looks like. Because they have already post pictures of him. But we're technically not 100% sure if that's the full version of him. Because they could, you know, change him up and stuff like that. And, um... Then after that is Godzilla vs. King Kong. Now if, um... Godzilla died in Godzilla vs. King Kong. That would upset me, yes it would, but I doubt he would die die, like, obviously, he's Godzilla, you can't kill him, you just come back. He's just gonna come back. Like in all the other movies. Frickin' GMK, explode, heart, still pumping, bruh. What now? I was getting to see it on enough. Sorry. Alright, so. Uh, what I really want to happen is in King Kong. No, not King Kong. Godzilla vs. King Kong. Uh, or Godzilla vs. Kong, or whatever they're going to call it. Uh, what I technically want to see happen is, like, uh, humans, blah, 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 and then we see, like, maybe, like, uh, something happens, and, like, King Kong's there, or whatever, whatever, and then, like, Godzilla's, like, what you doing here, bro? I'm gonna beat you up, and then they have an epic fight, like, eh, slap, eh. My face, fire breath. Psh. Now, the fire breath, I don't intentionally think it will kill King Kong. Because in the trailer of King Kong, he was like, Let me on my fire, swoosh, swoosh, y'all suck, I can't burn. So, what I think it's gonna happen is like, it's gonna blow him, like, but it's not gonna do, it's gonna do damage, but not like, uh, lose an arm damage. Uh, so... Yeah. And, like... I, I heard some pe lots of YouTubers and stuff saying that... Kong and, uh, Godzilla were going to team up. Which would actually be kind of cool. Well, entirely awesome. Uh... But it's kind of weird because I've never seen like, two ginormous kaiju's like team up. Like, how are they gonna team up? Like, they'd be like, "Hey man, we'll team up." Yeah, sure, we'll shake hands. 
they're gonna do that. So if they do team up, I wonder how they're gonna team up. And because they're not man, they don't know how to talk. Hey, you wanna be my best friend? Yes, Unless they talk through like monster voices, like. Oh yeah, 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 be weird. So, and if they do team up, I wonder what kind of mo- kind of monster they're gonna fight. Like maybe like King Dora comes back or something like that. But or it could be. A new monster. Now that is what this little boy would love to see. I love new monsters. Like, technically, like the scroll callers in the Kong. They're cool, but they're not. I don't really like them as much as the V Rexes and Peter Jackson's King Kong. Because technically the skull crawlers are like walking on two feet and they don't know how to like attack or anything. So they're like, dig, 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 dig. but yeah, they're pretty cool. Uh, I'd probably definitely get a figure of so a skull crawler, like if like NECA or SA's Monster Arts makes one, but I don't get that a Bandai crap anymore. Because I'm more... Back then, I didn't really know that there was movable, like, boop de boop uh, with the figures with, um, joints and stuff. So, like, I would be, like, looking for the Bandai and stuff. And so, I would I didn't really know Amazon or anything at that time, so I would be, like, looking in the stores. And I would, like, rarely find Godzilla figures. And then, like, my first ever, um, uh, uh, Godzilla with joints was NECA, uh, Godzilla 2014. That was my number one first one. When I first saw it, I was like, oh my god, look at this, oh my god, it's the best. What is this? What? And then I'm like... And then, like, I find all these other ones and Essays Monster Arts. I'm like, I gotta have it, gotta have it, gotta have it. I need it. I love it. And so I'm, like, getting a note to the NECA stuff, which is, with the Predator stuff, I wasn't really much into at the time. So I was mostly terrified of Predator. Because, like, face. What the heck is that? Oh. Goodbye. No, goodbye. And so, like, I, I hated his face. His face terrified me. But then I was like, I am a man. I'm a man now. I can do it. So I, like, watched the Predator movie, and I'm like, yeah, it's not that bad. And then I'm like, see the Predator movies, and I'm like, hey, Dad. No, no, not the movies. And I'm like, see the toys, and I'm like, hey, Dad, look at those uh, things from the, the blah, 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 blah. And, I'm, and he's like, boy, it's cool. Sorry, some smudge on my tab. And it's like, oh, that was cool, man. <laughs> oh, God, dude. And then I'm like, I don't really remember, like, what they look like. I remember one that looked bloody. Mm-hmm. And stuff. Don't judge me, I'm playing with my light. And so... Like, when I went to go get there, they were just, like, regularly looking. Stuff like that. So, my first Predator was, uh, I forgot what his name was. It was, I think it was, uh, Scavenge Predator or something. What do you, he has, like, a face of Berserker Predator and, uh, and he has, like, uh, I don't know. I customized him since he was so old. Weird looking. And then I got Wolf Predator, which is Wolf Predator is my favorite predator. And uh I'm getting a new one. I'm I'm getting uh what is it? uh Serpent Hunter. Which is he's pretty cool. 
I mostly like him because he has blades on both hands, like so I give it like double stab. Which is I'm probably gonna get SH Monster Arts uh heavy armored wolf predator because uh my thing called a cat Ow. I'm just scared I can't and I just hurt my finger. Uh chewed the uh the, the freaking the stabby make stabs. The blades, yeah. And stuff like that. So I and I'm missing one right now, so that's probably in the bathroom somewhere. Uh because I was doing something I was taking uh, I had a headache, so I was like, why not take a bath? Because, you know, I, I like baths. They're warm and comfortable, and I don't want to stand up. That's actually a lie. Alright, so, to be honest, uh, yes, I take baths reasons because they're comfortable I'm more relaxed I get more warmth and I don't have to stand up and that's probably it so I like I'd be like sitting in the water oh, this is nice. instead of standing with water going on me like, not getting my full body. And I'm like, I want this part to be warm. But if I move, this part's not going to be warm anymore. So I take baths. So I'm like, putting, uh, graphs on my figures. And I'm, uh, like, so I'm like, uh, looking at them and see if I can see any, like, extra detail or something like that. And I was like putting in with water, act like I'm cleaning them or something like because <laughs> I'm weird like that. Don't judge me. And so like I print technically put them on the floor and my parent one of my parents were like, Oh, you like to the figure in the floor. I just gotta pick it up and throw it in the other room. <laughs> and so like it's probably either in CC's room, my cat, or the bathroom. I have really no idea. I'll probably look for it tomorrow or something. So, back to King Kong and Godzilla. Uh, I would entirely think of, like, a few different new monsters. But, yeah, that'd be actually... It's cool to see a new monster. I'm not a hundred percent sure what sure sure what's going on with the Gamera movie. I've been heard I heard that it's been canceled and stuff like that. I have no clue. Which is I was excited for a new Gamera movie because like you know it's Gamera. Come on. And then I heard that there's a new Ultraman movie. And I'm like. Is this the best? I can't believe I'm alive for this. Thank you, Jesus. It, um, so, you know. And I have no clue about the Ultraman movie or the, uh... Game of movie. I'm sorry. I better hurry up. Because I'm not going to have enough minutes. So, uh... Tomorrow I might review about my thoughts on uh the Godzilla anime which is coming up this year hopefully and Godzilla Heritage which is I'm not 100% sure it's a movie but there's a lot of proof that it could be and I might make a movie I mean not movie might make a video about my fears like my greatest fears and stuff like that so if you enjoy this video like, press that like button, and subscribe, or I will find you and kill you. Now, see you next time.